asking this question in the diagram uh, in the diagram triangle K L M. So the K L M is similar to L and M. And we have to find the first. We have to find the K M. So K L M by K L upon L N and the L M upon N M and K M. Km upon L. So now we have to put the value. Km, Km is basically fifteen, and the Ln, Ln is ten. Lm is given as eighteen. Nm is not given, and Km is given is also not given. So Km. the km and lm is okay now we take this this fraction so 15 upon 10 is equal to 18 upon nm and nm is equal to when it goes to the left it becomes 18 multiplied by 10 divided by 15 15 goes down In the denominator and the five to the ten, five to the fifteen, three to the three, three to the eighteen. So six to the twelve. N M is equal to twelve. So N M is equal to here N M is equal to twelve. And we have to find the K M. So K M we can write fifteen upon ten is equal to Km upon 18. So Km can be defined 15 multiplied by 18 divided by 10 is equal to Km. So 5 to the 15, 5 to the 10, 2 on the 2, 2 on the 18. So Km becomes 3 multiplied by 9. So Km is equal to 27 centimeter. Actually, we have to We have to take this two term to find the Km. So we start from here for the Km. So, so when the n m is twelve, so k n become k n become twenty seven minus twelve is equal to fifteen. So here k n is equal to fifteen and k m is equal to twenty seven. Okay, now in second part, we have to find K N. K N we have found. K N is found as twelve. And the part three, we have to find the area of triangle P N and P N P M and K L. So that P is the point of. So we take P from somewhere there. So that these two lines become parallel. Okay, now the P F instead of the P P is the point L M and P S so that a P N is parallel to K L. These two lines are parallel. These two lines are parallel. And we have to find the area of triangle. So when when there are two triangles are considered, first is the smaller one. First is the smaller one. And it is like this. It is P. It is M. It is N. And the and so it is twelve. And one more pair. One more triangle here. That is a big, a big triangle. And it is well. It is L and K. It is fifteen. And it is twenty-seven, and it is M, and it is eighteen. Now both have become the same triangle. One triangle is A, and the whole is B. This is the B. So when we compare the two triangles, they are similar. So the area of similar triangle are become L one upon L two to the square is equal to A 
depend upon A2, the irrespective variable. So L1 we take as 12 and L2 is taken as 27 and this is the square and it is A1 upon A2. So we can cut it here 3 4 the 12, 3 9 the 27 and it becomes 16 upon 81. So A1 actually and PM we can write triangle N P M in your triangle N P M and the this K M and it can be written as K M as the big triangle. Okay, and the other hand, if we remove if we remove this area, this even area from this, so it become K L P and if we remove this area from this whole triangle, the big triangle, this one leave, left, K, uh, K, L, P, N, this one, left. So we can, we can say that if we, if we minus 81 minus 16, so it become 11 minus 6 is 5 and 7 minus 1 is uh, 6, 7 minus 1. So it becomes 65. Actually, the 65 is the is the area of this. This is 65, and area of NPM is 16. So this is the answer of this question. If the if we were asked to find the ratio of the two triangles, the, this was the correct answer. But it is not the triangle that the, it is a trapezium. So we remove this area from the 81 from the whole one. So, uh, oh, so the answer becomes 16 upon. 65 is the correct answer and we cannot simplify it so it is the simplest form so it is all about this question so if you feel any problem you can uh, write again i will do some more explanation for you